With this being the holiday season and because we're home more than ever, baking is in full force. And it's fun to be festive this time of year. This is so appropriate. Noah Lada is showing off some melting snowman cookies this morning. Noah, good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm great. I'm just happy to be here. Sad that we can't be there in person because of the dumb snow, but hey. That's all right. This in place. That's all right, Noah. We are happy to have you this way as well. Uh, you're making us melting snowman cookies. So tell yeah. me, where do we begin and what do we need? Okay, I'm going to have my assistant come on here because she's going to make one too. You might have seen her from a previous segment. I don't know. Anyways, so the most important thing you're going to need is cookies. These are just store bought ones because um, they're the fastest to get, or you can make your own. You can do slice and bake. Any kind of cookie works, whatever flavor. We use the vanilla ones, just sugar cookies. And then you're just going to need some icing. We use some white icing and some, we use writing gel here um, for that. And you can use like little cinnamon candies for buttons, a marshmallow for the head, and cut up orange slices for the nose. And then for the hands, you can also use toothpicks. So what we're going to do to start is we have our cookie. So we're just going to apply a bit of frosting to it. Kind of, it doesn't have to be completely even. This is going to be where it looks like he's melting. So just put a bunch on. Like I'm just going to put like that much. And then you can grab your knife and kind of spread out the icing here. So it's going to kind of work on spreading it. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's supposed to be a melting snowman. It's great for all ages because they don't have to make a perfect snowman. It's supposed to be melting. It's not supposed to be normal. There we go. So, All right. So we've so got our melted butter. snow. What's next? So then we need a marshmallow. And the marshmallow, we're just going to stick right on. So this is his head. And for his head, I'm going to use some writing gel, which we found at our Uncle Wise. And we're just going to go to his head. And let's see if we can show you guys this. So we're just going to take it and we're just going to kind of use it to make little eyes on each side. It doesn't have to be perfect. And then give him like a little face like this one's kind of sad because he's melting. Right, so we use frowns and we sometimes make them look shocked because they're melting, not smiling, right? Yep, and then I'm just going to use a bit of red gel for this. Um, something you can use, well the black gel is right here. Use some sort of gel icing you use, you dab right where the nose is going to go. And then you just stick a little piece of orange slice or whatever you want to use your nose right on top. Make this little nose. So then you just grab, for the buttons you can do rows. I'm just going to use some gel. I'm going to use red. Right, these are cinnamon candies. You can also use M&Ms or Skittles or it's any kind of brown. Buttons. And then if you want, like you can see on some of these, you can make a scarf around his head. Mm -hmm. You have a lot of options. So then for the hands, you can either use gel or right here, you can use a gel. I'm gonna use a toothpick. So just take a toothpick and break it in half and then stick one half coming out of each side. And now he has little arms. And the great thing about these is they're totally edible except for the toothpicks. So you don't really have to take anything off. So here's our little drooping snowman. Noah, I love this. What a great idea. Can you tell us you share a lot of baking stuff on your Instagram page? Yeah, um, a lot of sweet stuff at gmail.com, L-A-T-T-A, just like the name of the segment. Um, just search me up. I do baking tutorials. I do fun ideas, all kinds of stuff. So you can check me out there. Awesome. Thank you both so much for being with us. We miss you in the studio, but I'm sure we'll see you soon. We'll be right back.